We signed your peace treaty. What more do you want? Marvel Studios is on the brink of introducing a cosmic powerhouse into the Marvel Cinematic Universe, Nova. As excitement builds, what can we expect from this stellar superhero's journey? Let's find out. Nova, a superhero who's about to make a spectacular entry into the Marvel Cinematic Universe, right now, they're knitting together the beginnings of a story for this cosmic warrior. And at the heart of it all, Richard Ryder, known for his bravery as part of the Nova Corps, which fans first encountered in Guardians of the Galaxy. So. Have you ever wondered about the Nova Corps? Think of them as the cosmic cops of the Marvel Universe, making their first appearance in 1976 thanks to Marv Wolfman and John Romita Sr. Things get really interesting for Richard Ryder, the main guy from the Nova Corps, when his planet Xander becomes a victim of Thanos in Avengers Infinity War. Everyone's buzzing about how this pivotal event will weave into the broader tapestry of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Richard Ryder wasn't just any superhero when he debuted in The Man Called Nova number 1 in 1976. Crafted by the imaginative duo of Wolfman and Romita Sr., Richard's adventure with the Nova Corps gave him some pretty impressive powers. His popularity has been on the rise, making him a key figure in the exploration of the cosmic side of the MCU. His run-ins with the Skrulls, which we've seen hints of in Captain Marvel, and are eagerly anticipated in the Secret Invasion series are setting the stage for some major developments. The chatter about Nova and his potential role in crucial MCU moments has been building for ages. We're talking about everything from potential spots in Guardians of the Galaxy and Avengers Infinity War to a near-miss cameo in the final showdown of Avengers Endgame. Kevin Feige, the brains behind Marvel's magic, has been teasing fans with the promise of Nova's arrival since as far back as 2018. Fast forward to now, and Brad Winterbaum has now given the green light confirming that Nova is definitely on the horizon for some epic adventure. Let's rewind a bit to 1976. More of Wolfman and John Boskema gift us with Nova, Elias Richard Ryder, the sole survivor of the Nova Corps. This once mighty group had the power of the Nova Force shared among them until it all came down to Richard. Jump to 2011 and enter Sam Alexander, a younger Nova version, brought into the spotlight by Jeff Loeb and Ed McGuinness. Sam quickly became a hit, especially in animated shows and key comic plots. Yet, it's Richard's story that's intricately linked with the MCU, especially with the tragic fate of Xander at Thanos' hands, sparking endless speculation among fans about how this backstory will play into future stories. Since Guardians of the Galaxy launched us into a cosmic adventure in 2014, the MCU's journey into space has only expanded. Adding Nova to the mix seems like the perfect next step into the grand universe. Although we haven't seen Richard Ryder in action on screen yet, the anticipation for his debut, especially with Nova Prime's portrayal by Glenn Close, has everyone on the edge of their seats. Brad Winderbaum, the man guiding Marvel's ventures in streaming, animation, and television, has put any speculation to rest about Nova's storyline being developed. Speaking candidly with comicbook.com, he revealed Marvel Studios' shift towards a more traditional studio approach, focusing on a plethora of subjects, including Nova. He's particularly excited about Richard Ryder's story, expressing a personal hope to see it unfold on screen. Winterbaum's enthusiasm, despite the challenges of bringing such a project to life, is fueling the excitement even further among fans. This transparency about the development of Nova's storyline only heightens the anticipation for his MCU debut. With Marvel Studios known for pushing storytelling boundaries, Nova's inclusion is expected to be a milestone event, promising viewers an adventure as boundless as the universe itself. Nova's got a pretty sweet setup thanks to the Nova Force. Think of it as the ultimate power-up from some space cop buddy named Roman Day. With this force, Richard Ryder transforms into Nova, a superhero that makes breaking the sound barrier looks like child's play. It's like zooming through the sky, faster than any plane, with strength that can toss cars like they're foam darts. Bullets? They're nothing more than an inconvenience. And let's not forget his ability to take any energy thrown at him, like a fireball for example, and throw it right back. Yes, you heard that right. He can catch energy and pitch it back as these awesome energy blasts. Now, let's talk gear. Nova doesn't strut around in simple spandex. He's decked out in the Xandarian Star Corps uniform, which sounds as cool as it is. This isn't just any suit. It's designed to keep up with all of Nova's wild powers. It can take a beating in outer space, keep Ryder breathing in any environment, and yes, it's completely bulletproof. The helmet comes with all the bells and whistles, the radio, night vision, energy tracking, you name it. Plus, it can go from rock hard to super soft, so Ryder can just fold it up and tuck it away. But wait, there's more. 
Nova's uniform is not just about looking good and staying alive, it can mess with gravity, allowing him to float like it's nothing. It also lets him zip through hyperspace, meaning he can hop between stars faster than light itself. Need a new look? The uniform can change its appearance at the drop of a hat. Though, a word to the wise, don't get too carried away with the customizations. Nova learned that lesson the hard way with a little scolding from the Nova Corps. Things took a wild turn with the Annihilation event, Nova's uniform got juiced up, integrating the Zandarian world mind along with the full might of Nova Force. This wasn't just a power boost, it was a mega upgrade. Imagine having the collective knowledge and history of an entire civilization in your head. That's what the world mind brings to the table. It offers guidance, controls the Nova Force, and can even take the wheel when riders out. It defends against mind control, hacks systems, making Nova not just a brute force, but a genius level tactician. And if you thought Nova was just another face in the crowd of superheroes, think again. With powers and abilities that can rival the likes of Spider-Man, Nova stands out not just for his strength and speed, but for the unique flair he brings to the hero game. His ability to navigate the vacuum of space, unleash energy blasts, and sport a suit that's as versatile as it is durable positions him as one of the most intriguing characters to watch out for in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Kevin Feige, the guiding force behind Marvel Studios, hasn't kept his plans for Nova a secret. In revealing a discussion on comic books' Phase Zero podcast back in 2021, Feige highlighted this strategic timing of Nova's arrival, signaling a bold leap into the cosmic side of the Marvel narrative. This endorsement from such a high-ranking official in Marvel signifies that Nova is not just set to join the MCU, but aims to transform our understanding of heroism in the universe. The buzz around this Nova-centric venture is electrifying, promising to peel back the curtain for untold stories and characters within the MCU. The big question that fans are pondering is whether this narrative will play out on the big screen as a cinematic spectacle or take shape as a series which we can binge from the comfort of our homes. With characters like Iman Vellani's Kamala Khan making successful transitions from TV shows to movies, the expectations for Nova's story arc are sky high. Nova's entry into the MCU marks a significant shift from the traditionally Earth-centric focus of previous narratives. This move towards exploring the cosmos opens up a universe of new worlds and civilizations for audiences to discover. Experts are excited about the fresh perspective Nova could bring to space storytelling, bridging the gap between human experiences and outer space adventures. While the Guardians of the Galaxy and the Eternals have already started this journey, Nova is expected to dive even deeper, enriching the MCU with its unique mix of cosmic power and relatable human qualities. Nova Project is spearheaded by the creative mind of Xavier Pirzada, known for his stellar work on Moon Knight. This project promises to catapult the Marvel Cinematic Universe into new galactic territories. Kevin Feige, the strategic mastermind behind Marvel Studios, has expressed his excitement about venturing deeper into space with Nova at the helm of this exploratory mission. This move signals a bold new chapter for the MCU, inviting fans to explore the cosmos in a way that's been never done before. The anticipation surrounding the Nova project is electric. Fans are eagerly speculating about who will don the helmet of Nova, with rumors of casting decisions swirling around. This buzz underscores the potential impact of Nova on the MCU, introducing a character that could quickly become a fan favorite. Marvel's decision to push forward with its cosmic narrative through Nova reflects a desire to dive into new themes and stories, promising to enrich the universe with intriguing, fresh content. As we look forward to Nova's grand entrance into the MCU, we're left wondering how Richard Rider and potentially Sam Alexander will weave their stories into the fabric of this universe. The excitement for what's to come is sky high, but what do you think Nova's arrival will bring to the Marvel Cinematic Universe? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on this cosmic adventure.